What is a self-directed IRA? A self-directed IRA is simply an IRA that can invest in any asset allowed by law. Now, most people use a self-directed IRA to invest in real estate, private companies or private funds, or even cryptocurrency. Now, that's different from a brokerage IRA. A brokerage IRA is typically with the broker-dealer. Think of Fidelity, Merrill Lynch, TD Ameritrade. When you have an account there, they're going to let you invest in what they sell. They happen to be a broker-dealer selling financial products. That's what your IRA can buy when you have an account with them. Stocks, bonds, and mutual funds. If you happen to have an IRA at Northwestern Mutual or New York Life, what can you buy with it? Annuities, that's what they sell. Self-directed IRAs, on the other hand, are accounts that, where you can invest in any asset. So if you want to buy the duplex down the street with your IRA, do it with a self-directed IRA. If you want to invest in the pre-IPO company or the private fund that's offering better returns, you'll need a self-directed IRA. Now I always get clients that call me and say, Matt, I called Fidelity. I told them I wanted to buy the duplex down the street with my IRA and they said I couldn't do it. They said IRAs can't own real estate. What they're saying is IRAs at Fidelity can't own real estate. Your IRA can own real estate. You're just going to need to change the provider again to a self-directed IRA custodian like our company, Directed IRA, where we'll let you invest in any asset allowed by law. Now, I'm not saying self-directed IRAs are for everyone. If you're good at investing in stocks and mutual funds with your IRA, keep doing that. But if you're like, you know what? I found a good real estate deal I'd like to do with my IRA. I feel more comfortable with the returns on a rental in my IRA. There's a private company or private fund where I think I can perform better and have a larger account at the end of the day in retirement. Or maybe there's a cryptocurrency I'm excited about that I think is going to outperform any other investment in the stock market. If that's the case, you should consider using a self-directed IRA. Now our mantra has always been invest in what you know. So if you know real estate, private funds or private companies or crypto better than you know stocks or mutual funds, you're going to need a self-directed IRA. Now moving over to a self-directed IRA is easy. And you can just take a portion of your account. You don't need to transfer the full account. Maybe your brokerage IRA, you still want to buy stocks or mutual funds. But you can transfer whatever portion you want over to your self-directed IRA. There's no tax or penalty in moving from one IRA account to another. Whether you want to diversify your retirement or concentrate your IRA into these assets, a self-directed IRA is what's necessary to truly take control of your retirement. Now, if you want to learn more, get over to directedira.com. We have our webinars there, our podcasts. You can also schedule a free account appointment with one of our senior account reps. And you can get to mattsorensen.com as well to get my free self-directed investor toolkit to better help you take control of your retirement.